Hello, welcome to book number three. What did you study in high school? What is your major in university? Yes, education is what we want to talk about today. When we start school, first we go to elementary or primary school for five years. Elementary school or primary school, okay? After that, for three years, we study in junior school or middle school, okay, for three years. After that, we go to high school for four years. But depending on the educational system of the country, uh, the whole system is different. For example, in some countries, you go to elementary school for six years and high school or secondary school for another six years, all right? This is the old educational system of Iran. As you can see, elementary school or primary school, junior school or middle school, and finally, high school. Also, we have another option. Vocational school is actually uh, a period of time that you study art or technical skills instead of high school. Okay, who not is done? Vocational school. Okay, so repeat after me. Elementary school. Primary school. Junior school. Middle school, high school, vocational school. After you get your diploma, you start university. When you enter university, for the first four years, you get your BA or Bachelor of Art for four years. You study in the university. You get a degree of BA or Bachelor of Art for majors like art or human science, like psychology, sociology, literature, okay? BA for the first four years. If you study majors like, I don't know, medicine or engineering, you get your BS or Bachelor of Science for science degrees. After these four years, if you want to continue your education, you get your MA, MA or Master of Art, Master of Art, again for art or human science degrees. Again, if you are studying other majors like engineering or medicine, you get your MS, Master of Science uh, for science degrees. Then if you want to continue your education again, you can get your PhD. So, BA. BA, Bachelor of Art, Bachelor of Art, BS, Bachelor of Science, Bachelor of Science, MA, MA, Master of Art, MS, Master of Science, and finally, PhD, PhD. What if we want to talk about our majors? Whenever we're talking about our majors, we can say, I have a degree in psychology, for example. I have a degree in literature. I have a degree in engineering or uh, whatever. I have a degree in psychology is one way. Also, you can say, my major was, if your education is finished, you say, my major was psychology. I majored in psychology. Again, it means your education is finished. You don't study anymore. I have a BA in psychology or I have an MA in psychology. We talked about the articles before. An MA, a BA. And I have an MA in psychology, as I told you, and I'm majoring in psychology. The last one, it means you're still studying in university. I am majoring in psychology. Repeat, please. I have a degree in psychology. I have a degree in psychology. My major was psychology. My major was psychology. 
I majored in psychology. I have a BA in psychology. I have an MA in psychology. I am majoring in psychology. I am majoring in psychology. What was your subject uh, when you were going to high school or university? School subjects. This lesson is called exactly algebra. Algebra. Repeat, please. Algebra. Did you like algebra when you were going to school? Was your major mathematics in high school? Mm -hmm. Algebra. The next school subject is art. Art. Art is somehow easy for a lot of students in high school. The other subject is biology. Exactly. Biology. Next is, what is it? Chemistry. Very good. Chemistry. So the pronunciation is not chemistry. Be careful with that. Chemistry. Mm -hmm. Next is geometry. Geometry is the study in math of angles and shapes. Geometry. Geometry. The next subject is... This is somehow boring for a lot of students, but on the other hand, a lot of students love this a subject. History. History. How about you? Did you like history when you were going to high school? History is the other subject. And next is music. We didn't have music in school. I don't know about you. Maybe some special schools have music. Next big, physics. Very good. Physics is another subject. And finally, the last lesson is world geography. World geography is very useful, but again, it's somehow boring for some students. All right, world geography. Now, I want you to pause the video and categorize all, all these lessons, all these subjects. Some of them are related to arts, some are related to math, some are related to science and social studies. All right, pause it, go ahead. All right, categorizing all the subjects. Art and music are categorized in this field, math, very good. Algebra and geometry. Algebra and geometry. For science, we have biology, biology, chemistry, and physics. For social studies, we have got history and world geography. All right. Repeat, please. Art. Art. Music. Music, algebra, algebra, geometry, geometry, biology, biology, chemistry, chemistry, physics, physics. History, history, world geography, world geography, very good.